Okay, here we have a Back to the Future 2 Laserdisc unboxing. And, um, let's just say, yeah, let's just open it. Look to show you the back. It's about an hour and 48 minutes, extended stereo, matrix around soundtrack. So basically, that's just the normal thing for this. Now, these are all made in what year? Well, this one, 1990, it says down here. While I'm not, I say to place all the discs in those jackets. Um, yeah, but if the disc is inside this cardboard, I can only assume it won't get damaged. The problem is, is when you take it out. Now, unlike the first one, there was a ton of fingerprints on this. Uh, on this, yeah, on the first one. This one is just a few minor scratches, nothing big. Yes, it looks like there's some fingerprints over there. See. So this one isn't too bad. A lot better condition than the first one. But like I said, when you buy stuff like this, you don't really have a choice. These things suck. I, they really do. I don't know anybody. There's got to be. I know they sell better ones to, to to keep. I know anyone can deal with these plastic things for such long periods of time because you just don't know if they're gonna stay on or something might go wrong. Um, is there anything else that we missed on the back side? I don't think we did. Um, the laser disc, yeah, I, I saw that already. Um, it's always good to have this movie in, in any format. And I'm going to put this back in the, the wrapping. It doesn't really matter what way you put it in. You can just turn it around if you're putting it in, putting it in some case or something. Um, see? Having problems. All right. Bye-bye.